guys, what's up? So today I'm going to be doing my October favorites, and I love fall so much, so I'm super excited to show you some things I loved in fall that I have been using excessively. Um, I'm just super excited to start getting into the routine of November, and I just love fall and Thanksgiving, and leaves changing colors, it's great. So anyways, let's get into this video, and I'll show you my favorites of October. First, I'm going to start off with makeup favorites because there aren't that many. First things first, don't say it, is my Wet n Wild blush. Wet n Wild is a very inexpensive brand and this honestly works wonders. This is in the shade Heather Silk and it's such a beautiful color for fall because it's like a deep red with a hint of pink in the back. I don't really know. And then there's Shimmer too, adding a glow to your face. I'm currently wearing it right now. Probably can't tell. But um, it's great. I love it. And I'm super excited to use it with my Dallas bronzer for the fall time so they can complement each other. Because this is a more fall into winter blush rather than a light pink blush. Next, I have a makeup duo. This is the Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer in Nude. And I love this so much because it's so lightweight and I don't need a lot of coverage on my face just because I don't break out as much as I used to. I have like red scars on my face from my breakouts, but I just use this to cover up that so I don't need a heavy full coverage foundation. So that is why I just used the Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer and this still does really well coverage. With that, I take my e.l.f. Mineral Blemish Powder and I just put this on some of the spots to matte it out and just also it really like helps with breakouts if there is a breakout I put it where that is going to be formed and it helps mellow it down I don't really know how to explain it but these work really well together and this isn't like a setting powder it's just like a blemish powder but it still works really well and I really like using these together and they work well together so they're my favorite. The next thing is my makeup remover. I've been using these Trader Joe's Next to Godliness Micellar Cleanser and Makeup Remover Towelettes. And I love the packaging. And I know this might sound really weird, but I love the sound of the packaging too. Like, I love these packages and the sounds they make. I don't know. It just makes me feel very happy. Like, there's just those sounds that I really like. And this is one of them. And it's super weird, but, you know, I like it, so... We all have our things. This is my thing. These are very good to take off eye makeup. I haven't taken off face makeup with them, but I bet they could. I just washed my face to get off my face makeup, but this these smell really good, and they are very, very gentle, and they're just from Trader Joe's, and they're awesome, and they're all natural, and I really like them, and I'm definitely going to be buying another pack because... These take off my makeup like wonders, and like my mascara never comes off, and this is like the only thing that I can take off my mascara, and it's crazy. I don't know, I just really like them, they smell good, as I said, just everything about them rocks, and I really want to buy them forever. As I said, there weren't many makeup products, but now I'm going to talk about like beauty in general. So for hairstyles, I'm actually wearing my favorite hairstyle right now, and I know in fall you kind of want to like keep your neck warm, but this hairstyle is all up and off my neck, but I still happen to love it and stay warm with it. This is actually more neat than usual. Like usually I just put in a messy bun at the top and like let it like loosen up so it goes down to the bottom and it's like really loose and stuff, but this one I planned and like pulled it to the side and made it look messy, but you don't know that. You don't have to know that. I just really like how this looks, like the messy bun down at the bottom of my head. It really adds like definition to my face I feel like and I don't know I just really like it and I feel like it's very chic and cute at the same time it's comfortable and I don't know you can like dress it up or dress it down just do whatever you want and you don't have to like it you can wear it with a headband like I don't really know just do whatever you want with it it's you don't have to like it but I really like it and it's so cute so, since there weren't many beauty favorites, I have more random favorites. So my first random favorite is my phone case from Wildflower Cases. This is my favorite because I've been wanting a case from Wildflower Cases, but I haven't had a phone that fits the Wildflower Cases. And finally, I got the iPhone 6. If you want to know what's on it, go watch my iPhone 6 video. Um, but I just finally got one, and my first case I wanted was... A wildflower case because I hear so much about them and I'm just like what's the big hype so I looked online I found this one 
and it has no studs and I was super excited to see this because usually they have studs and this is like the first case without studs and I was like I'm getting it and it's so cute while still being super protective so that was another reason why I had to get it and I just really like this and it's so chic and I really like it and I'm so happy I bought it so some food favorites I was just staring at them and I realized not staring but glancing and I realized they're both chocolate mint so sorry but you know chocolate mint is my thing oh my god the holiday drinks came out at Starbucks yesterday and I went into Starbucks and I was ordering my caramel salted caramel mocha and I'm like can I have a salted caramel mocha and then I look up at the price and then I see right next to it says peppermint mocha and I'm like hold up just kidding I want a peppermint mocha non-fat decaf with whip please make it venti because go big or go home like I was so happy and they thought I was crazy but you know I am anyways my favorite foods of the month are first off York peppermint patties if you haven't tried this I don't know like they are just so good they're so delightful kind of like a big junior mint if you have ever tried junior mint I'm pretty sure you've tried a York peppermint patty they're so good and they are just so yummy I just love them so much and I've been eating these too much this month the next thing is actually like an on-the-go breakfast and this is a cliff builders protein bar with 20 grams of protein which is very good and this is in chocolate mint and this taste I know exactly what it tastes like it's a crunch bar with mint so usually stuff with a lot of protein does not taste that good and it has a weird aftertaste but this tastes so accurate it tastes just like a candy bar and I take these every day to school when I don't have time to make a breakfast and they're amazing so I am into watching like TV on the TV but I'm also in love with watching Netflix because that's what this system Society has come to so my favorite show of the month of October has to be Orange is the New Black. Orange is the New Black has become a lifestyle for me. I finished the two seasons in three days and it's come to the point where now that I finished I just can't stop re-watching it and looking up cast interviews and being a part of Orange is the New Black, I am an inmate of the Litchfield Penitentiary and it's come to that point and I really didn't think it would but it has. But in all seriousness, it's an amazing show. The storyline is like no other. I went in watching it thinking it was going to be okay, like a moderate show, but I got more into it and the storyline is so different from any other show that is on TV and considering it's a Netflix specific series, that's so cool because that's what this generation is. We binge watch and it's great and I can't wait for the third season to come out because I am obsessed. For Halloween, I was the one and only Alex Voss. I was pretty confident in my costume because it just makes me so happy. I don't know, the show is amazing and every actress in it is beautiful and Laura Prepon and Taylor Schilling are just my favorite people in the world. My music favorites for this month would have to be Taylor Swift's 1989. Can we take a moment, if you don't have this album, pause the video, open up iTunes and buy it, or go on Spotify or YouTube and just at least listen to it because it is such an amazing album and I am so proud of Taylor for going outside of her box and it's great. And in Another favorite would have to be a holiday album. It's November people, but yes, a holiday album, and it is Adina Menzel's Holiday Wishes album. I'm not going to give you a sneak peek because the songs are just everyday Christmas songs that she sings, and her voice is amazing, so if you want to hear an amazing holiday album, Holiday Wishes by Adina Menzel. So that is all of my October favorites for this month. There weren't that many. I don't know if I dragged this on or not, but whether or not I did, I hope you enjoyed the video. I love you all to the moon and back, and I'll see you guys next week. Stay glamorous, guys. Bye!